Disclaimer. The following video is part of a playthrough that contains these heavy topics. Viewing it is at your own risk. And with this, your discretion is advised. In the beginning, there was a voice. A voice I knew belonged to mother. Be a good girl, okay? It said. Then suddenly I knew what to do next. It's nice to meet you, I said. Please take care of me. Who was I meeting? Morning, Aiden. Oh, he's back to campus. Hmm, <laughs> these dolls are so pretty. Where do you get the materials from, I wonder? Not telling, huh? Well then, I'll leave you to it. There's no use talking to you when you're like this, is there? Welcome to there. Execution hour! Thank This program is supported by a white society. Hi everyone! Oh Um Ahem. Welcome to our daily program, the Execution Hour! I am do one out one or one. Okay. What do we have on do? Okay, nothing changed in here. Okay, yeah, TV room, nothing. Actually, uh, Aiden, um... Hmm. So, um, we got on here. Let's call it a day and get some rest. Good night, me. You did well today. Chapter 1 and welcome to White Society. Mm, man. Also, Chapter 1. How many chapters does this have? The god of this world told me a story about a girl who was the heroine of her story. About a girl who was bestowed with a gift. They could grant a single wish. However, however, were her wish to come true, she would die shortly after. That's the kind of gift it was. The girl wished for everyone to be happy. It was a kind, simple wish, full of hope. But all it did was destroy individuality itself. Oh. Because she couldn't define the meaning of happiness. In another timeline, the girl wished for the world to end. It was a desperate, messy wish. Full of despair. But all it, all it did was destroy only a fraction of the world. Because she couldn't gasp how big it was. You too can get your wish granted. That the god of this world. Because you too are the heroine of your story. Mm hmm That's cool today too, huh? I can hurry though so I can wander around a bit. Okay, it's still the same. Okay, without even asking me. Okay. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> hi, Aiden. Aiden. Good morning, dear. Oh, hi. Aiden, you're back. What are you up to? Ah, just finishing a new headpiece. Want to try it on? Of course. He gives me that and he was holding. It was my own scalp. Soon in ha into a hat. Here, yeah, let me help you put it on. So... How's it? How is it? Whoa, it's totally rad. Ah, I'm glad. To be honest, I'm rather proud of this piece myself. Come again later. I have a dress for you to try on. It's very you, I would say. Alright, I'll leave Aiden be. Nothing is alright. 
Yeah, uh, we are not responsible for the side effects caused by usage of link products, including brain damage, internal ulcers, full of partial body eye paralysis, hallucinations, and excessive sweat secretion. Funny, there's no mentioning of my light. Okay, yeah, it's still full of vomit. Still looks the same everywhere. Yeah, go to the basement. Oh, hi, Bennett. Sorry, no time to talk. My favorite show is starting in an hour and I haven't finished my errands yet. Why don't I visit the TV room later? So, Huxley, how's it go? Hi, Dr. Huxley. I'm not Huxley. I'm the robot version of Huxley that he specifically designed to talk to annoying children like you, puppet unit. Uh, no way. Huxley does the robotic engineering now? No, Florence did, Florence did that. But he took all the credit. Confidential information. I knew it. Please tell me you know how to make ice cream. I sure do. <laughs> Don't live in the kitchen's cupboard in case I need you. I sure do. Hey, are you going to agree to every nonsensical thing I tell you to do? I was told, told to obey your every request if it doesn't involve interrupting Huxley's work. Hmm. Oh, can you kill this worker for me? I sure can. The worker's head exposed? What the fish? I have a fear that these forms might have released the poisonous gangs. There is off limits. Wow, you're the best Huxley ever. Sir Archibald, tough luck. Oh my god, he's bleeding oil? How many of the workers are androids? Five total, only four left now. Nice. I'm placing my bets on Baldwin and Goodwin. They're too user friendly to be true. Did you call for us, Mr. Baltshire? Ah, yes. I mean, no. Abort operation. Aw. Live the very next moment. Completely losing interest in me. <laughs> See, Robo Huxley? They're so considerate that they feel bad about not spending time with me. No organic life form anywhere does that. Actually, soap can induce the fleeting feeling of affection and euphoria just for the tiny price of the sentience level trees. Oh god, the taxi include the advertising function you. You're now useless and I'm leaving. We already have six TVs for them. It's five. What is the microwave? Well, bye. Goodbye, Puppet Uni. These are resolved with limits. We're still done with consequences of the gas leak. Go away. I don't die here. Stop making more work for us. Okay, um... Hey, Honecker? Oh, looks like he isn't here. Maybe we can find something interesting while he's upset. absent. The deck collection of forensic classes on the Christian turtles and... He said the, he said the name! I'm going to stop putting inside the flasks. Let's go in post-it notes and research papers. There's some research right on the desk. Go take a peek. Hmm. Oh, so this is the stuff he's been working on. The Oracle and Mind Control. MacCat as disease uh, carries ice nine. Oh, Hanukkah, Hanukkah. Don't you know the rules? <laughs> you don't want to play. I destroy your research. Ah, uh, fine. I'll leave it be for now. Not a morning. The bell will ring soon. Let's hurry to class. I don't feel like going today. Skip with me. We shouldn't do that. We might get expelled. Who cares about it? No big deal. It is a big deal. Yes, you'll likely get by, but what about... Hmm? No, it's nothing. Are you going with me or not? It's just we'll have consequences. 
Aren't we going? Yay! Oh, while well, we're at it. Buy me something to eat, okay? It's kind of boring to hang out with you anyway. Uh, right. I'm sorry. Let's go to the canteen then. Can I get him to the room? Maybe these people just want to swim with the jellyfishes. Think of it, there are a lot of the Sai... Of the Sayoris lately. Well, yeah, it's encouraged by the white society too. Less troubled youth to worry about. Oh. Okay, I don't do that. Do, do. Oh, it's this famous spot for couples. Oh, is it? I like coming here alone. I just saw right now the bodies up there. Not that we probably shouldn't not sweat it, okay. Oh, the first time we're Cover principal is sitting at the table. But where's the real thing? No no, no one really liked him anyway. Inside the in A5. Yellow and order shoot and fries on the shelf. Read. Age 16 grade on me, yoga, public poetry, reading. Oh, huh, this is strange. What is? Look, is Niall supposed to be an honor student? Or her grade level is stated as mediocre. Maybe she's not as smart as we thought. How hilarious is it? Would that be? <laughs> Alright. Copy. Uh huh, drawing. Hi, I'm writing. The person inside the drawer is in five format. So it isn't. The drawers are full of colored blank sheets of paper. The rare of blue and purple student fans on the shelf. Of broken mobile games. Un unavailable skipping class performance. Which we feel high social network drawing. Full of blank white sheets of paper, huh? Bone and syringe lies discarding the floor. It still has some drops of the drug inside. They will find a room, you two. Then like they found the room. Those of your books here are reads design. The books will be the school textbook books you bought but didn't read, books you claimed to have read but didn't. Oh hi I know. Miss will try. Hi class rep. Why is Miss Perfect gracing me with her presence all of a sudden, I wonder? I'm keeping an eye on you. I haven't been doing anything illegal though. Hmm, have you really? I mean what about your white society activity? What about it? As I have said, I've, I haven't broken a single rule. Nor have the members. You should know better than everyone, right? Right. Let's go, Andre. Mind your own business about you, Miss Eiler. Why is the food now up there? Hmm, looks like the lessons have ended. Ah, oh, let's go get the food. Officer says the sign. Not today, self care. Henry, Henry, buy me any chips. Got it. Sour cream chip. Oh. I don't really like this flavor. But it's the only flavor there is. This one is busy vomiting in the. Hey, the food isn't even half bad. There's a whole club dedicated to it. There's a whole vomiting club! There's one was not over yet. Is it wondering? Oh, let's see if it be. How's the food today? Uh, thank you, I love it. Maggot soup, best to choose bubblegum, one piece perfect. Do you think these names are accurate? The food's usually pretty decent, so not really. 
Is there something you need? No, there's nothing. Go to the third floor now and to the rooftop. The rules of off limits, huh? Can't enter this place. I know. I've already been getting a lot of death threats from the members. Well, that's what you get for getting your data submitted to the White Society website. I haven't even seen any other White Society members other than you. Well, of course. Yeah, we suck is anonymous. We gotta ensure the safety of our members. So, um... Oh, um... Lada, there you are. Oh, hi. Hello. Are you guys free? Mm, kinda. Do you have any suggestions? Oh, I do. Why don't we go to Henry's place to study today? You're not against your friends coming over, are you? Uh, of course not. You all can come. You don't look so happy about it, Henry. You're imagining it. Let's go then. Ah, that's an action reached. Oh, sure. It's sure dark in this place. It's getting. I'm getting the creeps. <laughs> so, where's your room, Henry? Ah, it's behind the top right door. Bathroom. Very sturdy, I can see my reflection. There's an air freshener in the cabinet. Toilet. Really old. Okay. And okay. Oh. Are you sure you're not kidding us? This must be a storage room. You, I got squeamish just by standing here. There's no way I'm staying in this room. It's all I can offer, I'm sorry. Ugh. Please don't tell me you'll sleep on this mattress. Oh, why don't we get the, the drinks? Classic latte. You even care about anything other than food? Both girls look at Henry. Hurry up, Miss Warhol. Ah, sure. I'll be back in a moment. Leave the room. Why don't we explore the house while she's absent? Has to be a decent room, right? Let's find it. Hmm, okay. Duration it is. Okay. Tale of the Ink Princess reads the tile on the scrap of you. I choose these NPC companions again. I can't have inside the drawers. I'm s Okay, Gabe, sorry! <laughs> Sorry! Oh, what's in here, I wonder? What are you? Oh, Henry. I remember you saying you had a brother. Is he behind this door? I'm very sure I heard sounds coming from there. He is, right? Let's go say hi. No. Please, no. Stay away! What's the prick problem? We'll just greet him and leave. Yes, and hopefully not uh, not hurt him in any way or even touch. Just look, that's it. Don't open the door. Don't be so stuck up. Jeez. You open the door. The girls scream in unison. Understatable. Henry dropped the tray she was carrying. The lemonade spills on the floor. What the hell? What the hell is that? Wow. Don't look. Get back. Explain this, Warhol. Why is there a corpse in the room? I... Please, listen to me. It's been here since the start. What? My parents never let me see him. They acted like nothing was wrong. But one day I entered the room out of curiosity. I didn't know he was like this. Say, was he alive when you last saw him? I... He... It was... Self-defense. So you did kill him? But... This... This isn't human. No. 
God, no. I... And he runs away, retreating to the bathroom. The girls, in turn, storm out of the flat. Please. Oh, so traumatic. Hmm, what to do? Okay, I'll find her later. We're coming hanging on the wall. Okay. Henry. Hey, Henry. Are you okay? Do I look like I am? Not really. Here, a tissue. White society special. Hey, Lotte. What's so funny? You're smiling. Hmm? <laughs> am I? I'm just amused by the whole situation. It's just plain hilarious. Her backstory sure is complex for an NPC. I can't help but think. You know, my room is right across his. He's always in there, rotting in front of the monitor, never leaving. My parents fawn over him, and I have to be the one with perfect grades. And it's me who'll have to earn money from the family. Or he saw the state of our houses. Sorry, can't relate. I... I know, I'm sorry for bothering you. I just... It's just that... It's not only that, he... No, no, there's no way I can say it. Mary puts her head in knees and starts sobbing. Her tears are annoying. How do I make them stop? Shouldn't there be a special item for that? I pet Henri's head. Hey, stop it. No effect. You don't have to live here, you know. But where can I go? How about my floor? We have a storage room there. And my neighbors are dead. I'm sorry. I think I'll stay here after all. Fine then. Well, I'll leave you to it. I have a public execution to perform. Take care. It doesn't end, so. Leave her with a bag of sour cream chips. Oh boy. After this ex <laughs> After that I will just Well we live in a world of, of casual cruelty, yes. Farm farms Plantations Slaughterhouses. I mean, yeah. Animal test. Yeah, that's that's the worst. Millions of gallons of waste are produced every year. Mm-hmm. Together we can make a difference. What? That was a that was a weird change. Eat the garbage you produce. Eat Charles Charlie's junk foods. I was there chicken of shutterstock. And welcome to... <laughs> this one is supported by... No. Hi, everyone. I'm scared. Meet the star of today's show, Boy A. And yes, you're right. Once again, this is a complete total stranger. Nobody knows anything about. Not even me. Today, we'll be staging a play. It's called... I won't do that anymore. Now then, let the play begin. I'm sorry for everything I did years ago. I've really changed since then. No, this won't do. Be more specific. What exactly are you sorry for? I'm sorry for... For... Saying things I shouldn't have said. Like I said, be specific. I really don't know what you're talking about. Just reading the script. Hmm? What did you say? Ah, uh, uh, but I won't do that again. Ever again. Come on. Just admit you posted that right on your profile page. You said the T-word, didn't you? The T-word? It's a public network, so everyone saw it, you know? Oh, it's Twitter. 
Also, what he was. So look at what he did. Still skeleton, what are you even thinking? I'll still sleep with my teddy bear even. What? Why did you do it? Spill it. Uh, wh where did you find this? Hey, I ask you a question. No, um, I just, I just really like teddy bears. Yeah, right. But no one else does. What you said is insulting to all of us. And guess what? No one will forget from now on. I, I said I'm sorry. Now repeat it. I'm sorry. And again and again. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Bravo for forgiveness. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Say you won't do that again. I won't do that again. That's the spirit. Is, isn't it enough in our already? I want to go home. You know, it may have been enough for me. But we never know what the audience wants. Everyone, what now? What will we do to this horrible, bad, lawful person? Hmm, let's see. Oh, looks like you're lucky. Huh? Everyone choose the quickest death option. Oh, you'll not, I'll not be at you. Huh? No, it can be just for having a different opinion. So, so, <clears throat> oh, don't cry. Do you really think everyone would just let you walk away? I really want to let you go home, you know? But it's not up to me to decide. Looks like your fate was decided from the moment you made that post. Please, please forgive me. <clears throat> so sorry. Dear friends, please wait for a bit while I make the preparations. One, two, three. Sorry for the delay, everyone. Here we go. One swing and... Phew. What a clean cut. The world is tumor and now live as an upstanding citizen. This concludes today's program. Stay white with us, join white society. I will still say no. Just because of a no.